Hello, and welcome back. Um, yeah, here's my, uh, so, it's been a while since I made a video. This is going to be my second one so far. Uh, first off, I'm going to apologize for the frame rate and everything. There's really nothing I can do about it. I just need a better computer. And so I'm sorry. You just have to bear with me. But, um, I've got a lot more to show you this time. Uh, I'm not going to look through my inventory, I just find that pointless. So here's my base, um, same thing still. Um, yeah. I'll, first I'll go into my mine and show, show you everything I've did in, in here. Um, I've been working a lot on this, on everything. I actually haven't been in this mine for a while recently, because I just moved over to another island. Well, well expanded and um, took over another island. Um, Here's my gate to the nether. Um, worked on that. Um, didn't do much in there, really. Um, in the nether, all I did was um, make a trail to the lava. Get, find, er, basically make a path to lava. And to get on the lava supply. Yes, I made all this. Uh, I kind of um, OC or whatever it's called to make everything really nice and neat looking. When I play Minecraft, like so, that's why you'll see everything is all nice and squared off and such. Hold on. All right, just see if I can get that frame rate to be better. As you can see, this has changed a lot if you compare this to my last video. There's so much more organization in this. Now, this mine is really huge, and so I don't feel like it's going to show you all of it. Um, I'm mainly just showing you pretty much what I changed. Or, like, yeah, because I see I made this all nice and neat. Um, I also also discovered this. Uh, if that goes on for a while. That that ends right there. Um, at one point, this like this whole area is infested with um enemies, so I ended up making like, a secret path through here. To get from the other side because I was actually stuck with like one health left and like some diamond and stuff, and I really didn't want to die, so I snuck my way through. I'm sorry you have to watch me walk through all of this. I, I, I should really make it's not like um, a trail to get from my other, one base to the other like a lot faster. Make mine tracks, mine cart tracks, whatever. Alright, I don't believe I had this before. My second story. I made out of glass with lava lighting. Um, up here. Um, I made this for my spawn point. Like, well, I'll show you when it's at the top. But um, I made this for safe travels back to my base, or safe and fast travels. Cause like whenever I walk to my base, I'd always die and it'd be a bitch, and I have to walk back again. It's just retarded. All right, so um, if I want to, I spawn actually right here, and so um, instead of having to walk all the way back, I just climb up here. Press this button, and then out, it's supposed to pop a minecart. 
and then I just go and place it and take a ride. And it's way faster than walking back to my base. But, um, I've got to show you something up here. I shouldn't have done that, actually. Alright, this I kind of started working on and abandoned it. Abandoned it very soon after. Um, I don't know why I built it in the first place? I just kind of did, and then I decided to um make it um an MC Chris memorial type thing. MC Chris is my favorite nerdcore rap artist, nerdcore hip hop, whatever it is. Um, either way, uh, he's my favorite artist in that genre. And so I made a sort of a memorial to him. But this is one of the album covers right here. It's called from the album um, "Knowing Is Half the Hassle." And then here's the other album cover, which I actually messed up on, and um, which is "Life's a Bitch and I'm a Pimp." Um, and that was like what's it called a um chandelier type thing with a hole on top, so enemies could fall in there and burn and die, which I thought would be pretty funny. Sort of like a cathedral side room. That was my annoying sister, Jordan. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Um, this is a really lame trap I made. Um, if a mob gets the water, it'll flow towards the cactus and it'll kill it. <laughs> and now I've got to add commentary. That is unnecessary and stupid. Add that commentary. I what? Wait. What was necessary? Your commentary. Oh, it was very necessary, you guys. No, no, no. That was like an arrow. It makes me have to talk. Why don't you carry on? Why? Alright, here's my new base, or not new base, but new area I've been working on. Oh, um, It's a complete island that was hollowed out. So there's only one layer between me and the outside. And I did that all around the whole entire island. Um, this is my waterway. Uh, I'm gonna have a boat in here and cover the perimeter with the slow sand from the nether. We haven't gotten any yet, so that way I can travel to the place faster, um, but without breaking my boat. Um, down there is nothing over here. There's gonna be a pool, but I got rid of it because I didn't like it. And then um. I'll show you what this is later. You've already done on my last video. And this is my new mine when I was looking for diamond, which I always found some. Um, this is how I collect my lava. Um, I found a lava pool like all around here, and um, I don't like having lava pool, so I just separate every lava spawn point into a different square. Just to get a good look at how many, how much lava I actually have, and um, there's another another little portal that gets me back to my other base, like instantly teleporting there basically. There, so it's a, it's a lot faster um, than walking all the way back to my base. And then this is uh, the mine where I get my diamond from.
I just keep expanding this and expanding this to get more diamond. I've got like 15 di diamond from it already. And I do this up here. Although I haven't expanded as much and I stumbled upon a cave. Cavern. Um, that didn't, that only goes to right there, but then this expands a little bit more, but not as much as my cavern I found. Nothing really down there. That goes down there, then around the corner and stops, and I forget how long that goes, but it's no big deal. And that just goes down to bedrock, and then it stops. Oh, this lava pit is for discarding items I don't want. Alright, now I can show you what those tracks were inside my base. For You see this whole island here is hollowed out on the inside and that's what the base is. It took a, a day or two to do. Like... Of on and off playing, doing other stuff, you know, I have a life, so. Alright, you ready? Oh shit! Fuck me. Sweet. Of course, it's not as good as it could be, or as you've, others you've probably seen on YouTube. But, um, still, um, it was my second time messing with minecart tracks, so, I mean, it's good for a beginner, right? Um, I would, of course, love to make, I will add on more of a new track altogether. In fact, I might even, like, make a lever so that there's a card that switches between, like, three different tracks, and I just press the lever, and it'll switch, switch when I want. And um, I want to show you guys something, a glitch that I have, and I don't know others might have too. Shit. Didn't want to. Alright, here. Okay, does anyone else have that happen to them? Because, like, I think that's kind of weird how you just fall through the ground when you destroy the minecart under you. I don't know, in some cases it might be convenient, like, you can make special things to, like, to fall, it's a way to fall through ground, and so you can fall to another layer. Make a secret base underground that has no entrances except for that. I don't know, kind of interesting. But, um, it's a glitch, I guess, yeah. But yeah, I'm definitely going to make a better roller type thing later. It's definitely fun to make, and there's definitely a lot more I can do. Alright, I suppose that's all that's new. Um, so yeah, see you later.